Hey guys, welcome back to Invest Again, where we talk all about maximizing your financial potential. Today, we are talking about eight things you can do make the most of your payday. Stick around because the last four tips are the real game changers, and you won't want to miss them. But before we dive in, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe if you find this video helpful. Now, let's get started. Tip number one, pay yourself first. Picture this, it's payday, and your hard-earned money hits your account. Bills, groceries, credit card balances, they're all calling for a piece of the pie. But what about you? Warren Buffett, the investment guru, once said, do not save what is left after spending, but spend what is left after saving. Start treating your savings account like a non-negotiable bill. Pay yourself first. Moving on to tip number two, save for emergencies. You've paid yourself, and now you might be wondering, why do I need an emergency fund? Well, because life's unpredictable. Bad things happen to good people. We're talking sudden car breakdowns or unexpected hospital bills. That's what we call emergencies. So you've got to prepare for those financial surprises. But remember, this is different from saving to make money. It's about having a cushion to protect your long-term savings and investments. Tip number three, budget. Now I get it. Budgeting can feel restricting, but it doesn't have to be. Your budget is your financial game plan. It shows you how to allocate your resources correctly so you don't end up living paycheck to paycheck. It's not about scarcity, it's about control. When you have a budget, you can spend guilt-free, knowing you've got a plan in place. Tip number four, pay your debt. Yep, I know, it's not the most exciting part of payday, but it's essential. You've got to tackle those loans, late payments, and high interest debts. Waiting until later is a costly mistake. The longer you wait, the more interest you'll pay. So when you get paid, tackle that debt head on and free yourself from that financial burden. Now, let's talk about tip number five, invest. Don't wait for the perfect moment because there's no such thing. As Warren Buffett says, risk comes from not knowing what you're doing. Start small, set aside at least 20% of your income and invest in assets that can provide you with extra income. It's all about building your financial future. Moving right along to tip number six, create a spending plan. A budget is one thing, but a spending plan is where you master the art of sticking to it. Life happens, and sometimes you need to adjust. A spending plan helps you track your expenses and stay in control even when things get a bit chaotic. Tip number seven, keep some cash. Cash is king, and it's often underestimated in today's cashless world. Warren Buffett and Charlie Munger, two financial legends, keep billions in cash for emergencies and opportunities. Having some cash on hand is essential. It helps you avoid constantly dipping into your savings. And now folks, we've reached the grand finale, tip number eight, outsource time. Your time is precious and wasting it on mundane tasks is a no-no. Outsource tasks like grocery shopping, cleaning, and cooking. You can use that extra time to relax, meditate, or even create another source of income. So there you have it, the eight crucial steps to take when you get paid. But remember, the last four tips are the most important. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe for more financial wisdom. And watch the next video on your screen, Reasons Why Most People Are Broke.